Hey guys, it's Rob. This is my latest creation. It's a Taro 650 Sport Kit, but what I did was put um, longer arms. It's now 840mm size. The arms are about 20cm uh, longer than the uh, standard one. And uh, the reason I did that is because I wanted to fit 17 inch propellers. At the moment they're just 15, but I've got some 17 inch props on the way. And uh, the motors I'm using are Sunny Sky 4110, 340 kV. So it's designed for 6S batteries, but it flies perfectly fine on a 4S battery too. I'll just give you a quick overview of how big it is compared to the Taro 680 Hex and also a Hobby King X650. So you can see it's significantly larger there. But one of the really cool features, and it did take me a bit of time to get these working properly, is the uh, retractable undercarriage. They're working 100% uh, reliably now, and one of the reasons I wanted to extend the arms was, on the stock kit, the, uh, when the legs are retracted like that, they actually extend out past the, um, the motor mount. So I personally didn't like the way it looks, but this one looks fantastic in flight. Um, yeah, but some of the little problems with the, the gear, these uh, linear servos, if they overextend or over retract, uh, they become jammed. So what I had to do is just adjust a, a couple of little shims in here that stop them going all the way down. And you'll see it sits at a nice angle anyway, but once I put those shims in, they're just 100% reliable. And I'll just try and give you a, uh, a comparison of the motor size. The, um, the hexacopter here has got uh, Sony Sky 3508 motors, and you can see the, uh, the 4110s are quite a lot larger. They're just beautiful, smooth motors. This is just a 4S 5000 milliamp hour battery, and I flew for 22 minutes last night when I was testing. So uh, with the actual um, 6S battery, I'm trying to get a, a large capacity 6S battery. I should. Uh, get at least 45 minutes, possibly even close to an hour, but uh, we'll see. Thanks for watching.